Hey guys, so I don't know if this is going to be the first video on this channel. Um, I don't know how I've got everything worked out just yet. This is just the first one that I'm starting with because I'm starting like right now. So I figured while I was doing this, I had to get some footage of this so that I can have this for this channel as well. <sighs> so I'm so excited I can't even talk. So right now it is like 2.45 or something in the morning. And of course I live in Stanton, Virginia, which is like really, not really haunted, but it's like very historic and pretty much kind of haunted. So, or so they say it's pretty haunted. Um, so my boyfriend and I was driving to the gas station earlier and there is the Stanton train depot down here, which is a railroad track that a lot of like the confederate soldiers and everybody took back in the day and apparently um like i'll have more history on it like when it was built and all that i'll have all that probably in the description box because right now i'm just so excited i don't even want to go through all that i just kind of want to give you guys an idea of what we're doing and then show you guys what we're doing so <laughs> so we're going to the stanton train d depot or the Stanton train station which is very very old and they say that it's haunted because since a lot of soldiers confederate soldiers used to use that railroad then they say that it's haunted and that you can still see the soldiers there and everything so me and my boyfriend was riding by there earlier and we were talking about you know going to go check it out or some something sometime and he was like do you want to go tonight and I was like are you serious like my boyfriend's really not into this like I'm surprised he's like, no, you're on your own, but he's going to go with me. We're going tonight. I told him I want to be there around three o'clock because that's supposedly when you get a lot of like paranormal activity going on anyway. So I will be taking my phone. A lot of it might be dark, but this is going to be like a little paranormal vlog. I don't really know if we're going to see anything. Like I'm not going down there really to capture anything. I'm just going to really see what is there. I'm going to do some pictures and some want to film some of it, get some footage, and maybe do like some um, recordings just see if I can pick up anything from like a phone recorder because I'm not taking much with me. I'm taking my phone and a flashlight and that's it um, because I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to be down there at 3 o'clock in the morning and it's right behind the courthouse. So yeah, I want less stuff as possible. So we're going to get ready to go down there and be there around 3 o'clock. We are going to be doing all that, getting the recordings and some footage and all of that, some pictures. And I also have a ghost app on my phone. It's called a Ghost Observer. Now, I don't know if it's true or not. I've had some pretty weird um, coincidences or experiences myself with this app. So I kind of believe it. But then again, I still kind of don't because it's an app. So with all that being said... I just wanted to open this up and tell you guys that me and my boyfriend are getting ready to go down to the Stanton train depot or the straight or the Stanton train station in Stanton, Virginia, and we will be on our way shortly. So I'll see you guys once we get there. You pray. Um, all right, you guys. So I literally see it right in front of me. I know you guys cannot see me. No, you don't see the ghost. Just tell them you see no, the ghost. Well, no, well, <laughs> No, I okay. see it right there in front of me. Like, <laughs> no, no, you don't. No. Okay, no, I'm downtown. Scaring the shit out of people. And I see, <laughs> I see where we're supposed to be. It's like right in front of us. Like, if we just gotta keep going straight for a little bit, and we're going to be in the area that we need to be. We're here, like. Like we're looking right at it. Like we got across the street, and we're there. So after this light turns green, we're there. But we're going to pray before we go in because that's just something that I do. Even though I like the dark and the paranormal, I still I believe in God and Jesus. And yeah. Yo, I'm scared as shit, yo. And he's scared, and I'm not really scared. I'm I'm banking on not seeing nothing. That's why I search because I don't I never see you. anything. So I'll show you guys this once we pull up here and pray. I'll turn you guys back on and show it to you guys. But it's like really weird because we're passing the courthouse like right now, and then we're where we where we need to be is right here. So we're like, like it's right here. He was right here at this flag. Yeah. Okay. All right. So uh, um, we're gonna I just pray. Turn around. Turn around. <laughs> no. But that flag's it's it's right here. All right. So we're gonna pray, and I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, let's go. So hold on, I'm gonna show you guys real quick before I get out. Since well, let's the light, get out. Let's get out. Well, the lights right here, so I want to see. Let them see what we're looking at. Okay, so hold on. Let's 
so this is the like the train station and the railroad tracks are right back here um, I saw a picture where somebody took a picture right here and the soldier I am the soldier appeared right here so I'm gonna turn you guys off and take a picture with my flash and I'll insert that here in the video somewhere So it's dark and I don't think you guys can really see there's a bridge over it and this right here in front of us is the actual railroad. These are the benches and like where you wait. You guys really cannot see but this is like where you wait where the benches and everything are. And there's rocks and trees up there. So I don't know if we just stand here and wait, but I'm going to just keep taking shots. Since you guys really can't see anything, I'm going to just keep taking pictures. And we're just going to wait here for a while and leave. So Babe says he feels like something just like brushed his leg. He says he keeps feeling something brush him. I haven't felt anything. I don't feel anything. I don't sense anything. Um, I pulled out the voice recorder and asked a few questions. Did I get anything? I don't know. We might have to come back in the daytime because all the sounds of the night like the crickets and Not the sound of crickets. I think that's some kind of animal. Did you hear it though? Yeah. I'm gonna get the fuck out. I told you, I'm, I'm ready to run. So I'm gonna just take a few more pictures because I don't want to hang out too long. Because I don't want to get arrested for so, being here. Oh, what is that right there? I don't know what that was. Is that like underneath, like an underground tunnel? No, that probably goes from the street up here. That's probably the roof to something. Okay. See, I wonder which way does he walk from? Like, we're looking for signs and shit. Oh, that's good. I saw, uh, you saw oh, What is that right there? A pole? Nigga, you can't. You don't even have glasses on. I got my contacts in. You think I'm out here blind? Alright, this one might get, start getting kind of creepy. It's already creepy under here. Like, I don't know if you guys can see, but we're. Like, in some random area. But we're just walking down, kind of away from where we parked. Oh, I hope my hand wasn't on the speaker this whole time. I'm going to have to see if I can brighten this footage for you guys. Because I can't see anything on this camera. Like, what's showing up on this camera is not what I'm seeing. So here's downtown. Oh look, here's an old wagon. And there's downtown.
I don't think he'd be down this far. Wow. Because I don't. We ain't even went nowhere. Yeah, but I don't think that people. Like, I don't think he's gonna be right. Right here. But I don't think that people just like walk this whole thing to see him. Like I think he's got to be somewhere in easy access. Cause down here you start getting into cliffs and things. Okay, you guys. So we're walking on the tracks where he supposedly walked. Do you know somebody ha literally hand built these? Yeah, like way back in the day. <clears throat> you see how like rotted, let me rotted some of this is. We didn't see anything that we could physically see. Um, we didn't hear anything that we could physically hear. I took a bunch of pictures and try to get some footage um but they say they see him here i don't know if i don't know if today is just not his day or not his time i have no idea but i mean do you want to walk down that way a little bit yeah we can because we walked to basically where the red lights are for you to stop and i mean for the like the, ooh. For the train to stop. I just heard something. It sounded like a click clack. Um, but we walked down to like where the red light is for the train. And you can see like clear across the other side of town. But I didn't see anything here on the tracks. But even though I did not find anything this time. I will still come back a few more times, a few more different times, a few more different days, and just kind of see what's going on. There's the bridge up there again. So does he walk under the bridge? Is that why it's lit? I don't know. You could walk on the bridge. I mean, we could walk down here further to actually, like, more of the station part. Come on. Just be careful with it. So now we are back up here in the actual station. I wish you guys can see. I'm going to have to come back tomorrow during the day and actually show you guys what we did today. So I'll put this and that together. Stay behind here. Stay behind yellow lines. Walk your right ass over here. Or you might. Here's a weird ass creepy building. You want to take some pictures? Like shine it in there and take pictures. There's broken windows on the other side. All right, I'm gonna take some pictures, you guys. Not like this. Why not turn it off? Right. Or you just want this footage? Uh, you, you can't. So you're gonna have to get it back like that. That's crazy, man. How I take a picture? Stop the recording. Well, I'm I'm doing this. Is that taking pictures? See, it's a good thing Babe comes along. He doesn't really help me much with my beauty channel. Like, he don't ever want to be involved. And he's helping me out with the hair normally. What's these old lights? Like I said earlier, you guys, I will give you guys more of like a backstory and a history to this. It was just, I was just so excited. Trying to give them some good footage, like, what are you doing? Are you still recording? Oh, shit, here. <laughs> Bad folk. Who did you think I was talking to this whole time, the ghost? There's some old stairs. Damn, these, this, a serious stone ladder right here. <laughs> Is it maybe up there for us to see something? Like, do you think that's supposed to lead us somewhere? Can you take a picture? Mm -hmm. 
but I'll try to come back tomorrow. I'll try to come back tomorrow for you guys in the daytime and actually show you guys what this place looks like. Sounding like I hear a train. Do you hear that? Mm hmm. But yeah, I'll try to come back tomorrow during the daytime so you guys can actually see what it is that we're looking at right now. There's the bridge. I used to walk across that like all the time back in the day. It is a train. Soldiers about to get off this imaginary just train. Yeah, at this time, yeah, that's weird. While we're here, yeah, that's and weird. it just comes through all of a sudden. Like I was waiting for this to be a fake, like a ghost train, and for the soldier to get off. We snap pictures as it's going by. I don't know if he's on it, if he's trying to get on it, if he got off of it. I don't know. I told Matt, just I would just snap any pictures of anything. And we were filming the whole time, so I'm sure you guys will get a lot of footage in it too. But it, right when we got to this bridge. I was like, I keep hearing the train, and we, we turn around. Yeah. Yeah. 
blew the string at the top and she puts it down. Oh, well, we still didn't go down there, but I'm kind of scared to go down there now. <laughs> I don't want another train to come. I so, I'm going to stay on this side. Yeah. I thought <laughs> we, we was too close. Like, it's just creepy being back here. I really wish you guys could see. Oh, look, this is a story. Seashell Bridge. Seashell Bridge. That's the bridge that they rebuilt. That's that big bridge up above us. And then us. here's this right here. Yeah, that's the Stanton train station. That's where we are now. And like I said, I'll try to come back in the daytime to give you guys an actual better footage of it. But how cool is this, you guys? Like, it's right here. So, is that where he walks? Up there at the top? No, that's not the ghost. I mean, that's just the work. But is, is that what they're showing you? That he walks up top? Because he, that's a bridge. That's the bridge that's above us. Yeah. The Sears Hill Bridge. And that's, that, that looks more haunted than any fucking thing. No, this is haunted. Show, show me, you can show me this. Here's the wagon. It's some kind of old wagon. I really wish you guys could see. And then this is like another part. I guess she would wait for the train here. I'm sorry if some of this footage is out, you guys. I don't know about it over there in the side of the basin, man. It's like a pipe. Is there anything in there? No. But yeah, my finger has been over the speaker most of this footage, so I hope you guys can hear. I think before we leave. I want to walk down there. Before we leave, though, I think we're going to go up on the bridge. Um, I don't know if this is like somebody's backyard or what this is. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to go up to the bridge, and then it'll be time to leave. But like I said, I'll come back multiple different times just to try to catch what other people catch. Oh, I finally get to show you the little city we have up there. We walking all the way across that bridge. Oh wow. Shoot. I need to. I mean, in the daytime. Yeah. Like I keep going, I can't walk up it. I had to redo it. So here's the stairs to the bridge. It's a long journey. It's long. Not really long. You have to smoke the cigarette up here. You have to? You want to go get them? You want to go get them? Yeah, yeah. yeah, I mean, the bridge is right here. Okay guys, so we came up here to this bridge. We got like this one more flight of stairs to go and then like the bridge is actually like right there. Um, but I turned my phone off and I had like 50 something percent when I <clears throat> turn it off to restart it because my flashlight wasn't working. And when I turned it back on, I have 7%. So I don't know if that means that something's out here is draining my battery, I don't know. But I just think that that's kind of weird that I would have 7% after I had 50 something percent so that's awkward we're gonna go up whoa we're gonna go up the stairs the final set y'all had a panic attack coming up here it's way different than I used to remember it or maybe I'm not as ballsy as I used to be but these stairs are like giving me a heart attack I'd rather so, see a ghost than go on these stairs oh so what's over there when you're going around up there, there's the setting area up right there. Right there in those little bushes? Uh-huh. Like right around the bushes. Yeah. 
Damn, this is too hot. Okay, guys, so we made it back home. Um, it is like 3.50. So we spent about an hour there. Um, we didn't see anything, like I said, that we could see. I'm going to put this footage onto my laptop and see if we can get anything off of there. And um, I want to go back sometime during the daytime so that I can actually show you guys what it looks like and show you guys what we saw. Um, and there's some plaques that I want to show you guys and get some pictures of. So I'll go back and compile like daytime footage with the nighttime vlog. But it wasn't creepy as I thought. Like the only creepy thing is that the train just randomly happened to come by. So I don't know what that was about. Um, and when we were going up the bridge, I got so nervous. Like, I don't know. I used to go up those stairs, like, all the time. Yeah. Somebody was over here. Why? Because th when I cut the grass today, this was not open. Do you think the wind blew it? No, it ain't, ain't no fucking wind. Do it. Okay, so back to you guys not seeing me, but like I was saying, Babe had to use the flashlight to see something in the back of the house. Um, for some reason, we're walking in the backyard. Um, but yeah, I'll go back during the daytime and get some footage for you guys. So you can see daytime compared to nighttime. Like I said, we tried to go up the bridge, and I used to never be scared of that bridge. And I couldn't, like, the first couple steps I took, I was just nervous. Like, my legs buckled up. I was just, I was, I was not feeling the greatest. Um, but like I said, I'm going to put all this footage on my laptop and see what we got. And then we'll go back during the daytime and a couple more times at night. But I'm going to just compile this with the daytime footage and then save the other nighttime vlogs for later. So, thank you guys for coming along with me. Now we're going to pray before we go back into the house. And, um. Do you know when you walk, you turn the key on? And all. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I'll see you guys later.